Hello everyone, my name is Flippy, and in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to turn a video into an animated GIF using GIMP. First, we need to have the GIMP animation package installed. You can find a link to this in the description of the video. After it's installed, restart GIMP and you'll notice a new tab called Video. In this tab, go to Split Video into Frames, and then to Extract Video Range. Alright, now we're going to browse for our video. By default, it's going to open you in the My Pictures folder, and the browsing system is kind of messed up, so to save time, it helps if you have your video already in the My Pictures folder. Okay, now click the Video Range button, and if a message pops up, just press Cancel. So what Video Range does is it allows us to preview our video and select which part of the video we want to be our GIF. So make note of the frame it's on while playing the video and choose where you want the GIF to start and end using the two boxes below. For example, I want the image to start on frame 16 and I want it to end on frame 180. Now under audio track, change that to zero and on output mode, check mark create only one multi-layer image. Now press OK and it's going to load our video into GIMP. So now we can see that it loaded our video into GIMP, although it's a bit too big. So go to Image, Scale Image, and scale the image down to whatever you like. I'm making an avatar, so my image is going to be pretty small. After it scales your video, we can now make our GIF. So go to File, Save As, and you can name it whatever you want. Just make sure you have the .gif at the end. And in the box that pops up, just make sure you select Save as Animation. So now we're given a few more options on how we want our GIF to play. The only thing I really recommend changing here is the delay. Whether or not you want a slow or fast image is entirely up to you. I'm choosing a delay of 40 and that plays it about the same speed as the video. So now all we have to do is just save our image, open it in Firefox and we can see that everything is plain fine. Although we do have one problem. If we open our image in another web browser such as Internet Explorer or Google Chrome, we will see that it's playing our image in slow motion. Why this happens is because Firefox is a faster web browser and it can process frames faster than Internet Explorer or Chrome. So to make sure it plays for everyone, we're going to have to do some additional editing. Open up GIMP and reopen the image that you just made. Now go to the Video tab and select Split Image to Frames. After it gets done processing, a new page should pop up. Just X both your projects out and go to your My Pictures folder. All these files are pretty much our GIF split up frame by frame. And because IE and Chrome can't play these frames fast enough, we're going to have to delete some. So click on a frame, press delete on your keyboard, and then press enter. Then go to the next frame and do it again. What we're pretty much doing is we're deleting every other frame. And yes, you are going to have to do this for all of your frames. Trust me, it's going to be very tedious. After you get through, go back into GIMP. Then go to File, Open Layers, and select all the frames. Once it imports our frames, just go to File, Save As, and just like last time, name it anything you want, just add .gif at the end.
and of course save as animation. Now under our GIF options, we're going to change the delay to 10 and then we're going to save. And now we can open up our image in Firefox or Internet Explorer and it will be playing at the same speed. Any additional delay is probably due to my screen capture software and you might have to play around with the delay settings to get it to the exact speed that you want. Alright guys, that does it for this tutorial. I hope it helped you out. If you liked it, please comment, rate, subscribe, and I'll catch you next time. Thanks.